we're going to do something a little bit different. The question today is, are there craft games, like in arts and crafts, not Minecraft or Stardew Valley or anything like that, are there regular craft games that crafters like us can play? Let's go to Steam and find out. So, I am going to put on my my gamer head today. I play a lot of casual games. I play, you know, like Animal Crossing, My Time at Sandrock, those kind of things, Stardew Valley. Um, I used to be way into my little DS and anything casual or idle games, that was my thing. So, I was thinking the other day, I was like, are there games that you know, it actually has crafting in it. I mean, you could make a building in uh, Animal Crossing, but can you like make a pot or do some cross stitch or, you know, let's do this. I searched around and when I went into Steam, it if you just put craft in, it's gonna come up with all these, um, you know, Minecrafty type games. So what I had to do was get very, very specific. So I had to put in pottery, and then I found something. I had to put in um, sewing, it, that you get the gist, right? So let me show you a few of the games that I found, and I haven't played them yet, so let's find out. All right, this first game we're gonna play is Fantasy Blacksmith. So, this looks like a VR game, to be honest, the way it moves. Uh, let's look around and try to go in here. Will it let me? Aha! Keyboard. So, we gotta figure out how to click in. This is not very user friendly, I can tell you that. E to interact, or I need to read. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so let's try. Oh, shoot. All right, we're back. <laughs> so this is not, when do we get to blacksmith? Uh. Permanent skill tree. Can we get a temporary one? Let's see here. I am trying to figure out how to move. Ah, ha, ha, ha. That's much easier. I'm going to the basement. <laughs> here we go. All right. And why can't I hear anything in this game? I thought I did. Oh, now I can. Alright. We get the good old medieval noise. Can I go outside? No. Now I am used to a Nintendo Switch controller, so this, uh, Xbox One is gonna throw me off. I'm gonna blame it on that. <laughs> uh, let's make a dagger. It's a thingy plus a thingy plus a thingy. Okay. Oh. I have customers. Hello, sir. Should I give you a dagger? I don't know. Okay. So A to interact. Got it. So we need a dagger and a dagger. Okay. How exactly do we do that? 
I don't know. So we need... Uh-huh. Sure. Okay. Now I chose this one just because it was crafty, but in all honesty, I have never forged a single thing in my life, so... Um, so we need... We need wood. Copper. Oh, it's dropping in the... And that. Do I have money? Oh, I do. <laughs> so I got this. Oh, oh, this is exciting. We're doing something. Uh, do I put it over here? Okay. Oh, I need all of them. Can I, like, grab them all at once? Like a normal person? <laughs> no. I thought I had more stuff. What? I need that one. To drop in? Oh, there it goes. That's not what I wanted. I wanted... fine. I lost. I don't know about this one, guys. Let's try the next one. Okay, now we're gonna try Master of Pottery. I have done pottery before. Pottery? Alright. I don't know Italian very well, so let's do English, huh? <laughs> Ooh, pretty. Start. New beginning. Create a name. Okay. I want to make that. Put on headphones for better experience. I guess. Whoa. What? I tell you. This is a better looking game. Oh, this is nice. <laughs> a very tiny radio. DB, my friend. I have to go out to participate in some activities. It may take a long time to come back. I left this place for you. I hope you can manage it better. Is that a threat? Mason. Okay. Blue and white, exquisite pastel color glaze. Oh dear. Okay. Make the first work. Oh boy. Okay. How do I. Am I doing it? Am I doing it? Am I doing anything? Oh, I, I think I am. Oh, here. No. How do I tell if I'm doing something? Oh. oh. I see. Press and hold the firing button. What's the whole firing button? Okay. Oh. Use the right mouse.
Oh god. Oh god. No, no, no. Too hot, too hot, too hot, too hot. Go down, go. Not high enough. Oh, it's beautiful. <laughs> Ooh, I get to paint. Okay. Nice work. I didn't do anything. Press and hold the sinister. Oh, I thought that said sinister. <laughs> Sits. Whatever that is. Oh. Um. Hmm. <clears throat> Name it. UFO. I don't know what that is. <laughs> oh, oh, I thought that's what I made. <laughs> oh, lovely. Okay, I can do that. And do that. Oh, I'm going to put my UFO there. Oh, my work of art. Next day. Okay. All right. Oh, I should. I'm selling this for thousand dollars. Ooh, three people like it. Five people like it. <laughs> this room is beautiful. I call this UFO. million dollars okay thank you <gasps> I made 60 bucks all right, all right let's make a real one I'm liking this one I want to make a new uh, I have a letter oh, oh, okay from Mason yeah whatever Mason leaving me the store DB, I heard that the showroom has been opened. <laughs> That's right, and I'm taking over. It seems that you have successfully completed the first step. It is good. Next, please make more works. Hey, man. So that more people will visit. He seems very condescending. <laughs> there will be not many kinds of materials in the warehouse. I thi think... Can't. You can't. Yeah, and Mason can't spell either. I think you can often go to the store to see new materials and purchase more materials. It is essential for making great works. Please accept the money. I will contact you later. Wow. It's giving me $2,500? Alright. And why? Who's playing the tambourine? Okay. Uh, escape. Uh, whatever, Mason. Make me do all the work. I am going to make another thingy. This time, this time will be for real. All right, all right. We got this. We got this. This is very zen. You know what would be nice is if there was like feedback that you're doing something. I can see it. But, oh my, how tall can I make it before it collapses? <laughs> can I make it pretty tall? Will it actually fall? Let's find out. Can I make it really, 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 really tall? Or was there a max? Oh, okay. I'm gonna make this really funky. Actually, take that, Mason. Who needs you? Just leave me. I have no idea what I'm doing. Perfect. Now, let's fire it. Oh, I have to hold it. <clears throat> 
Good job. Thanks. Okay. Can I do like different colors? I don't want basic. We need basic. What? Oh, <laughs> looks like lips. <laughs> Not quite what I was going for, but. Yeah, we don't like that. Looks like a bowling pin. Green. What you think? Oh, oh. I want to be able to just paint it. Can I do that? <gasps> I can. <clears throat> Will that ruin it? No. I say no. All the colors! The concentration. Beautiful. Perfect. Put it in the fire. <clears throat> I call this Willy Wonka. Done. Display. I'll get thousands of tourists this time. That's my first exhibit. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, this one, my much bigger piece. This is going through my candy phase. Oh, I have nine. There's more people. I might hit, hit double. To, oh, look at that. 14, 15. New record. People are taking pictures of it. Jeez, I didn't realize how huge that was. <laughs> And I made $200. Cool. Okay. Let's make one more. Yeah, I could play this a while. <laughs> um, oh, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to make something. Let's make something. Let's see how tall we can get it. No, let's see how wide we can get it. Oh, I see. If you go down, it goes down. Oh, I'm figuring this out. I want it very short. Perfect. <clears throat> now I want it to go out. As far as it went. Yeah. Oh. This is slightly mesmerizing. Cinch in that waist. There we go. What if you could do this in real life? Probably not. It'd probably fall apart. Perfect. Getting good at this. As long as I don't, I can uh, right click and left click in a real life um, kiln. No problem. All right. So I want. Okay. 
fire. Hmm. What should I name it? Hmm. I'll name this one. Ooh. Okay. Money. Because I'll get hundreds. Oh. Made five hundred and sixty dollars. Okay, I will say this one's a good one. I can probably play this a long, long, long time, and this whole thing is going to be full, and I'll make millions and millions of dollars, and I'll buy out Mason, and this will be my store now. <laughs> All right, let's try a new another one. The next one, Toy Tinker Simulator. Tensions, tie toy, to, 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 blah, blah. say that 10 times fast. This version you'll be able to repair 10 toys. I think this is a demo, which is fine. This is kind of what we want to see if this is even worth buying, right? Oh my. Toy Tinker, wish the full version of the game. <clears throat> All right. New game. New profile. PP. Accept. Let's try it out. Uh, yeah. Because we don't know what we're doing. This section shows your level. Okay. Oh. Section shows the toy repair progress. Okay. Section shows badges. Section will appear when you need to use tools and equipment. Tools! This section opens in the music. Oh, okay. The most beautiful music channels will be, are waiting for you. project. Make more money than I spent. This list shows the toy parts and the required repair parts. This music is a little bit. Hang on. Let's bring that down a little bit. I mean, as groovy as this is, we're gonna Boop. zoom in on the toy. How do we do that? Oh, I gotta click it. <laughs> Turn around the toy and examine it. Oh, how am I getting behind this? <laughs> am I really small? No. Okay, okay, okay. Zoom in on the white outline. Got it. Okay. Pull up to remove the toy part. What are we uh, removing? Oh, we removed the whole thing. Oh, oh, okay. 
Are we supposed to take it all apart? Whoa. Drag and drop the tool to the correct location. Um, do we know what the... Oh. Move up the tool. Oh. Now we want to take it... I guess we're taking it apart. Okay. So we get our tool, and we go boop, and then we go boop. Now we're crafting. Send the part of the toys to the next process. Okay. Okay. Ultrasonic cleaner. <coughs> this needs to go. Uh. Ah. Okay. So you gotta get close enough to do it. Pull the toy apart. Oh. Got it. Okay. Return to the center of the workbox. Oh. Zoom in on the equipment. Oh my. We're learning how things work. Okay. Start the equipment. And this is how you make Wolverine. Wait, what? Uh, send the toy parts to the workbench. How do we do that? Zoom on the workbench. Yellow outline toy parts are ready to assemble. Okay. Okay. Oh, it just goes there. Okay, got it. They're all over the place. I'm not a very nice, neat, orderly. Well, that seems realistic. Uh, now what? Oh, 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 bling, take a photo, okay, oh my, we gotta get something for the Insta, there we go, ta-da, before, after, and then you get hundreds of comments, I liked it before, because it's rustic and pretty. Oh, I gotta deliver the toy. Here you go, sir. Give me money. Uh, deliver? Bling! Woohoo! I made 120 whatevers and 240 experience. Alright. Yeah. This one's kind of cool because uh, you actually learn how to use all the, the machines and things. I could get into this. It's a little more involved. Let's uh let's try one more. All right. We got another one here. This one's called Such Art and it says you to use a controller, so I think I can do that. Ooh. I opened this before, but I haven't played it officially yet. Let's do a new game. Oh. I don't know, keyboard might be easier. Uh, let's be a she today. Oh. Actually, I kind of like that better. Okay. Let's try. The year is 2130 and you have received the results of a professional compatibility DNA test. Oh. Your genome indicates that you have rare artistic talent. Why, thank you. For decades, art has been largely dominated by robots and other artificial intelligence. 
Hmm. But in these times of artistic perfection and homogeneity, <laughs> the world of art has become stale and in need of renewal. That's right. You need real people to do art. It is time for you to act. You have been assigned a studio Ooh, on board the International Space City. Ooh. So you can fully express your artistic self. Wow, I didn't know this was in space. Cool. As on Earth, the threat of a robot revolt is rising. An alien species, the Krabucks, covet the planet's salt water. Ooh. We can just eat crabs, right? Only you can decide what to paint on your next canvas. Alright. I'm going to paint crabs and offend them. Hello? Is this what space is like? Oh, whoa, whoa. Let's do the control instead. Uh, how many floors are on here? Oh, okay. Welcome to space. Uh, up my apartment is... A sixty four three. Okay. International Space City. Okay. All right. Okay. Now we can play this. Two, three. Woo -hoo! Oops. I gotta figure out the controls here. Oh, this is my apartment. Okay. Welcome to your studio. Um, okay. Mm. Thy box. Welcome to your studio. There are boxes everywhere. Is that normal? This studio will still be under construction. I can't express my fault. Some equipment could not be installed before your arrival. Some of them are essential to your work. I will be soon for some other equipment. However, I'm afraid that you will have to pay. Of course. Okay. Paint me a great piece of art. Okay. Paint a beautiful painting of a unicorn with plenty of colors. Okay, okay. You have shamefully forgotten your sister's birthday. Paint a large painting and send it to her. Okay, let's do it. Where do I paint? Oh, I have a feeling it's up here. Where am I painting? Over here? On the wall? This would make sense. <laughs> Got it. Large canvas. Which one's the large? Is this the large canvas? Or do we know? Okay. How do we. Or is that the large canvas? It's that down there. What's this? Ooh. Earth among things. Ooh, it's a floating hamburger. Okay. I'm normally left handed, so this is going to be interesting. how it moves. There you go. Magnificent.
This is magnificent. Ooh, I can mix colors too. This is um some uh, modern art here. This is hard to do with my right hand. <laughs> I do like how it um, mixes the paint. Beautiful. He looks uh, scared. Send painting to Kindle. Send. Bye. You shamefully forgot your Okay. Oh, that's nice. Oh, I think she liked it. I think she liked it. Just receive my unicorn. Well, I have the digital version. The real painting will take a little longer to arrive. Um, your unicorn is a little weird, but let's say it's approved. I'll name it Ragnarok because <laughs> it looks like it'll bring about the thought. name. What a great name, I know. I thought of myself, so I'm having an online call with some friends of mine and I'm showing this stuff. Cool. Your creator license has just been successfully activated. Woohoo! This one's pretty cool. It takes a getting used to, but I could see uh, getting into it. Such a nice. Don't mess up the studio. <laughs> <clears throat> so yeah, this is kind of cool. Um, found a few. Such art. Um, I could see it, once you figure out the controls and you're on the space station, it's, it's very neat. I did like that. And uh, uh, I liked the Tinker Toy one. That one. I could see learning a lot about the tools and the machines. That was very, probably the most realistic one. My favorite was the pottery one because I could see doing the smoothing and all that stuff. Definitely like that one. And I will probably continue playing that one. Actually, I'll probably try all of them, but um, this will taste uh, of a few little crafty uh, games that I found. They were very hard to find. Um, so you know what? If you want me to do some more reviews of this, uh, these type of games, give me some suggestions in the comments. Go ahead and uh, leave a comment of uh, some crafty games that you uh, found and you want me to give it a try. I'm willing to try anything. So um, yeah, I hope you like this different format, right? I thought I would give it a try and uh, I'll see you in the next one when we actually use our real hands.